How's it going, YouTube viewers? This is Gustin951 here with another tutorial with Fraps this time. Um, I'm going to show you how to do with screenshots and how to make screenshots and etc. So, make first thing you do when you have Fraps open and you have the screenshots tab open, uh, make sure you know the directory of where your screenshots are saved and where they are located. Now, some of the formats that I recommend on saving is PNG. Now, you can also save them as other formats if you'd like. I'm, but my recommendation is PNG since most programs open PNG and save uh, as PNG. Also, PNG also saves better color than JPEG in my opinion. Uh, but everyone has their own opinion and with their color theories and etc. But I won't stay stuck with that. Um, we'll go, go on along. Now, the screen capture hotkey. Make sure you know your hotkey, which it what it is. Um, I don't recommend disabling it because when you disable it, there won't be any way to uh, take a screenshot of your gaming experience or your video experience. Now, if you have it disabled, you have two options to either click on none or to enable and it'll say press any key. Now, I normally have it as F10, but you can save it as any other um, letter or, or uh, character that you like. In this case, I'll just save it as F10 as usual. Uh, that is the default button and I prefer it to be F10 because I'm, I had normally used F1 through F8 in other games that I play. So it all depends on your taste and what how comfortable you are with your keyboard. Uh, some other settings that you have here on the right hand side which is only two options. First option is to include frame rate overlay on screenshots. Now this is just um, to see the rate as you, when you when you when you see when you're recording movies, which I'll you'll see in the other uh, tutorial, it'll give you a frame rate on how on how how many frames you could uh, your game is playing and giving you. Uh, that is just giving you the option to see it or not. And the next setting here is repeat screen capture every so and so seconds until hotkey pressed again. Now what this is is that. It'll it'll take when you hit the hotkey. It'll take pictures after uh, screenshot after screenshot. I'm sorry, um, every 10 seconds in this case, or you can also edit it every five seconds. Now this I recommend choosing it if you want to see your Minecraft experience. Like you could, it'll take picture every 10 or or whatever how many how many value you put into it, and you can see your your house being grown every so and so seconds. Or you could also put take uh, take screenshots after screenshot uh, for your sim city so you can see how your city grows after every so and so second but that's basically it and right now I'll show you an example with Minecraft since it, it is pretty simple now I'm gonna stop the recording with uh, Camtasia due to Camtasia not being able to record smoothly on gaming um, gaming games what well, I'm not sure how to say gaming games but anyways on games actually I'm terribly sorry for that but I'll be right back and I'll record, be recording with Fraps and showing you how it's done, basically. Okay, and we're back. Okay, I'm going to be recording both Camtasia and Fraps. Now, it might be laggy for right now because I'm recording with both programs. But as you can see, um, I'll, you'll, you can see the numbers on the bottom right, which is red. That means it's recording, and when it's yellow, it means it's not recording and it's all neutral. Now, right now, as I was going to show you, I was going to take a picture of an F10 and just hit the F10 button and it'll take a snapshot real quick. Okay, and we're back here with Camtasia again. I'm terribly sorry for this, but I'm going back and forth for the game experience and also showing you the program itself. Now, as I said before, when you're done recording and everything and taking the snapshots of your, of your work and artwork and everything, you go here where it says view from your um, from files directory after you click on view you'll see right there of your picture your frame rate now if I did have the repeat screen capture every 10 seconds now it, it'll be capturing um, picture by picture every 10 seconds as I said so that's pretty much for this tutorial thank you very much for watching and hope you guys have a nice day